As a Nobel Peace Prize winner, Kailash Satyarthi was to many an unknown. Yet on the streets of India, he is the man who has given childhood back to children. His life dedicated to freeing young lives from slavery. Every day he seeks out those too young to know that a life of forced labour is modern day slavery, outlawed in every country of the world, yet practised in most. So far, he's taken 80,000 children from drudgery, returned them to their families and given them the chance of education and freedom. Every time when I free a child, I feel that it's a small victory of liberty over slavery. Every time when I free a child and see the smile on the face of that boy or girl, the smile of freedom, when I see the tears in the eyes of the mother who lost all the hope that uh, child will ever come back and sit in, sit in her lap, their faces are like faces of God. Kail Yash Satyarthi is careful to identify those who need to work to help their families and those trapped in enforced labour. But he believes that poverty does not deny the right to childhood. Freedom is so powerful, let me tell you. Freedom is so powerful because it is divine, it's truth, and it will prevail. Slavery is a man-made disaster. Slavery is a man-made sin. It's a man-made crime. And it would be defeated eventually. Defeat will come child by child. The word spread by those like Amar Lal, now grown and free to pursue his dream to be a lawyer. They rescued me and they got me a chance for education. So I want every child should be a get education. 168 million children are believed to be enslaved right now, but that is a figure in decline. I will see the end of child labor in my lifetime. That is a mighty claim, but it is fueled by hope and determination. Emma Murphy. ITV News.